You're number one, I'm two. Come on, boys, let's, let's go. Uh, uh, a little bit. All right, let's get this Wampus. You'll never get him. Look at your father kicking your butts. <laughs> No, 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 you can't throw that out. Mule was like the best game ever. Better than Angry Birds? It's about these colonists. They land on this planet and they have, they have these like really cute like robotic mules that you, you outfit for food and energy and smith ore. And it was awesome. Really? Hmm. So let's talk about the game Mule. Did you play this when you were a kid? I did, yes. I played this with my mom and my dad my brother and a whole bunch of my friends and pretty much anybody I could drag in to play with us. And I do remember on more than one occasion, um, my brother and I managed to talk our parents into playing with us and, and we would all sit around the TV and, and the couch and, and play together as a family. And it was really one of the few really strong, you know, good memories I have of my family together. My name's James Haynes and I'm the art director for this project. I played Mule for the first time a few months ago and for having been made so early on in the history of video games, I was quite surprised at how complicated and engaging a game it is. Yeah, catchy music. Well, let's play. What's this? No. Alpha Colony will be a tribute to Mule, and finally off for the modern update the developer was working on prior to their death in 1998. While we're retaining much of the original feel of the game, we're also updating it for a modern audience. Specifically, we're exploring elements of the popular Settlers of Catan board game, along with social and smartphone aspects from Words with Friends, all wrapped up in our own unique visual art style. I have so much respect for Dan and his team over at Ozark. You wouldn't believe what I've got in the attic, because no one has ever seen that Mule. We look forward to seeing our dad's legacy continue. Alpha Colony is an economic simulation, similar to SimCity or Civilization, that offers an interactive experience you can share with your family and friends. First, you purchase a plot of land, sort of like buying a property in Monopoly. Next, you head to town and buy a mule, and then outfit it to be a farmer, energy producer, or miner. Lastly, you move across the map and install your outfitted mule on a plot to begin producing food energy or smith ore. If you have enough time left, you can even hunt the elusive wampus for extra cash. At the end of everyone's turn, random events or disasters impact the colony, and your mules will produce their resources. Players can then buy and sell their resources to maximize their profit. The basic gameplay is simple, but mastering supply and demand on a remote colony is not. Deciding what to produce and when to trade it makes for a compelling and fun experience for the whole family. Like the original mule, this world is populated by many different characters, and each species will have different racial benefits. Mule, the multiple use labor element. What you have to realize about the mule is, it's not just a piece of equipment, but a character with emotions and a somewhat temperamental personality. So we've given him a nice big face to show lots of emotion and some arms to convey some body language. We really wanted to create a character that the player could feel a sense of attachment to. At the end of the day, it is this expandable tool, a Swiss army knife for planetary colonization. And it's this key aspect of the mule that we really wanted to bring up to date with these cool transformer-like animations for when the mule is outfitted and installed on a plot. The player transforms the mule, the mule transforms the world, and it's these events that bring the colony to life. To bring a tribute to mule in beautiful 3D on the iPad won't come cheap. As an extra bonus for our Kickstarter supporters, We've partnered with our friends at Mule Returns. They're doing a faithful remake of Mule for mobile devices. We are doing a modern tribute for desktop and mobile devices. Pledge to our Kickstarter today and enjoy both officially licensed classic and modern interpretations of the greatest video game of all time. I need your help to make not only my dream, but that of thousands of Mule fans out there a reality. For a small pledge, you can be part of building an amazing game. For a bit more, you get behind the scenes access to how a modern video game is made, access to early beta testing, and a forum with our developers. 
you will be a part of our team. I promise we will spend every dollar making the best possible game that Dan would have been proud of. Thank you to the truly awesome retro fan community that helped make Alpha Colony happen. We heard your cries from you on the iPad and we got the game this far. We need your help to finish it.